In the darkest recesses of your mind, there is something dark and foul and scary, something that fills your nights with dread and your every minute and every moment with fear. For me, that thing is the darkest dungeon. Why? Well, for one, it's very, very unpleasant. It is probably going to kill you, and the possibility of all your characters surviving is null. Now, what is the first thing you need to know while going into the darkest dungeon? Well, it has to do with the fact that you are not safe. Not you, not any of your little friends. And then you've got four of those, by the way. They come in 12 different classes, and really, they can be quite useful at times. Unless, of course, you get them killed, which really is. Corruption has soaked the soil, sapping all good life from these groves. Let us burn out this evil. Quite easy. No question about that. Ooh, look at Vladi, for example. She's got a few issues, haven't you, Vladi? For example, she is fascinated with corpses. And as you just now saw, her fascination is unhealthy, to say the least. It got her yet another disease. Or Virgil. He steals things. He just stole treasures that could have really, really helped me. Which means that I'm honestly wondering whether to ever use him again. F bloody thief. Continually onslaught. See, Itsu? Destroy he can be counted on. All. Useful guy. Faithful. Not that Virgil isn't useful. He's in fact probably my strongest character so far. He hits Therefore, for a hell of a lot. Broken. Maintain the offensive. But when he steals, well, you can see how we have a problem. We need to keep the torch lit. If we allow the torch to fall below 75, bad things will happen. Very bad things indeed. Now this, this was smart on my part, if you'll allow me to say so. Hmm. I think I'm going to take Confidence him out. As the now we've got a body on the floor. Darkest Dungeon didn't always have the body mechanic. They actually added it sometime after I originally bought the Early Access Edition. It was quite rather interesting, but some people disliked it. Quite a lot, too. I don't know why. Hmm. Let's see how core energies are going to react to our lovely little thief. I should have taken more bandages. Less of everything else, more bandages would have been good indeed. Let's see. He's not marked, but it will be falls, enough. Anyway. Hope blossoms. Let's pull you back. Time to get rid of the bodies. This is going to be bad. Ah, uh, three bleeding effects, really? There's you one damage per round. At least it's not too scary a bleeding effect. I've had, I've had far worse. Best to heal Itsu. Good Vladi. Diseased by plays and all manner of other awful things, but still good. 
because the brigand blood letter he's going to take a while to kill with those 35 hit points of his well Virgil is going further and further into the madhouse prodigious size alone does thankfully not dissuade the sharpened blade. A particular hit quite strong surprisingly so let's see can I do something about any of those good folks no time to continue onwards not yet let's see who heirlooms very good quite a fine Nature herself a victim to the spreading corruption malformed with misintent listen to that guy he's he's got such a badass voice here he sounds he sounds amazing I wish I had a voice like that if I had a voice like that well I'd probably be a lot more popular than what I was doing but hey it's not about the popular Ugh. I only had one shovel this is going to be painful without tools of iron you must rely on flesh and indefatigable uh. purpose explosion nah. not good as you might imagine not too bad either they're actually kind of weak but they have the unpleasant press this advantage give them no quarter ability to Resurrect if you don't kill them both immediately. Just like that. Right. That probably won't be enough, will it? Just to make sure it doesn't come back. Have a bit of heal from poor old Magnus. That's me, by the way. Totally looks like me. Uh, yeah, you see what happens when you don't kill them quickly enough. This is going to be a problem. Better to get on the decision part. Because, well, letting this go any longer than it has to would be... Let's just have quite the mistake. I think I've got it well in hand. Or not. Sadly, I've got nothing. Ugh. Monstrous size has no intrinsic merit. Unless yes, inordinate yes. exsanguination be considered a virtue. Come on, let me hit... No... Are we done? We must be done. Surely we're done. Finally. This took a lot These longer than... Creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. Left in luggage. It has a lock on it. Let's use a skeleton key. Hmm. See, the skeleton key's value returned tenfold. Yet another room lacking anything. That's bad. Battle? Obstacle? Another obstacle. First we'll go to the room battle with Curio. Then we shall return and face yet another obstacle which as you imagine is just going to Make me far more insane. This will. Hmm. Fine. Well, that was completely wasteful. Thank God for that. It is a. Uh, 
kill the little bugger. Someone dropped this recently, probably on the run. It has a lock on it. I don't have a key. Mm, probably will bite my hand off. Ah, huh. good. I got more than I expected, which I don't mind at all. Another disarm trap. Nature's stress levels are actually going down. The way is lit. The path is clear. We Good. require only the strength to follow it. A few deeds here, a few deeds there. The tree has a huge hole in the trunk. Perhaps there's something inside. Hmm, a blightstone. Useful, especially for a particular class I can think of. A class that uses blighted things far too often. Ouch. These guys, they are bad for stress, especially those. Damn. Let's pull. Or let's not pull. Of course, one of them is going to dodge. This is going to raise my stress levels too much. And what they do, of course, is that they dim the light. Which, if you haven't noticed, is bad for many different reasons. The main of which, because I only have two torches left. Again! Damn. Right, taking care of them one at a time. Let's the see if you can survive quakes. this. Ooh. Thank God for good old Magnus. He's a skilled little fellow. Yes, I bet you can't. That was not perfect. Seems I will have to end this quest on a very bad note. You know, before I started recording all these, I really did quite a lot better. This expedition at least promises success. Yeah. I'm not sure about that, but if you say so. Damn. Time to get back. I have too little light. Of course, I am going Mechanical to miss the trap. Possessed by evil intent. Right, I actually used the wrong vial, which once again pictures me as a dimwit. Not perfect, not at all. Hello dead body, goodbye dead body. The radiant light. Ooh, he didn't steal the gold. That's a rare one. Now the thing is, by the time I get to the last room, I'm going to be in a very bad position. I'm going to be completely panicked. In a single strike. And half my guys are going to be insane. If I'm lucky. That's if I'm lucky. I'm not lucky, Virgil is going to bite it. Since I have two healers, perhaps I can do something about it. Let's see. Of course, 
You're going to dodge. You useless guy. Remember what I was saying at the beginning? How this game is... The thing Grievous I fear most. Injury. Oh, Fifteen! Do you realize the chances of that? And breadth from becoming unwound. Well, if you die, Virgil, that's purely because you are a kleptomaniac and you got it coming. Okay, you can't count on poor old Magnus as much as you'd like to think you can. Should have taken a shot. Not swung a blade, because five points of damage. <sighs> Let's see. That might help a bit. Might at least get me to heal him a tiny bit more. Right, he's alive, but for how long? Success so clearly in view, or is it merely a trick of the light? Shadowy. Oh, your result. Ah. The walls close in. The shadows whisper of conspiracy. Well... Things are looking... just... peachy, you guys. Really. And more spiders. How can spiders with so little health be the cause of so many awful, awful things happening? One down, three to go, but last time three were enough to completely Ruin me. He resists the stun. I just need that green one out of the way. Because now she's going to start quoting the Bible. Or whatever religious order she's a part of. Let's see. Oh, powerful. Anger is power. Unleash it. Yes, it is. And now the true test. Hold fast or expire. Of course, he's going to miss. I'm so close now. Please save him. Whew. Right. He's going to die any minute now. Well, that's the battle's done. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. There's a chest I want to open. A long forgotten strong box sits. Let's see. Is it something good? Hmm, yeah, sure. Useful. Come on. Time to go back home. Let's see how much gold we've the got. The agents of pestilence will yet be driven from our woods. Ten thousand gold. That will hopefully help me with all the mental scarring my characters have ended up with. Paranoid bad. Very, very bad. 50% damage in world. I don't know what on world means. Oh! Are both of those good? Or the green thing? The green thing is a, is a disease. They didn't have diseases back when I first started the game. I don't like diseases. Not at all. Dud hitter. Right. So see, things are looking worse 
in the estate of the Dark Buccaneer. We dug for months, years, an eternity. And we were rewarded with madness. Oh look, Vasi is a drunk. She refuses to leave the bar. Oh! Jose engaged in flagellation or yeah, let's let's take it with Jose. Engaged in flagellation and recovered 81 stress and is no longer selfish. That's good. Oh and I've unlocked new buildings. Hmm. Oh the world is the name of the bloody place, I see. Fair enough, fair enough. First, before I go, let me see At what this is. Wild places, oh, I a see. Stalwart survivor and a strict instructor. In some maps, the larger maps, you've got camping skills for whenever you camp. Because uh, about halfway through, you get to camp. And you need a lot more food, a lot more of everything, really. Those are more difficult missions and I haven't done one in a while because they are scary and one needs a healthy team which I currently don't ha have. But the good thing is that now I can upgrade the camping skills and unlock new ones, which is good. Trinkets and charms gathered from all the forgotten corners of the earth. Because I can also buy trinkets which really I don't want to do and I can also recruit new heroes I think I'm going to take another healer a sister of battle pious and unrelenting and another highwayman in elusive useful evasive, persistent righteous traits for a rogue indeed I'm going to take another place here and hopefully soon enough I will be able to do some real damage to the enemy. Thank you guys for watching and I'll be looking forward to seeing you next time. Vladdy darling what are you doing? What's up with both syphilis and the black plague? Come on now. You're a reasonable girl.